So once you receive your product, you want to unroll it. Now there might be wrinkles. So what you want to do to get rid of them is you want to turn it around, roll it the other way. So then when you turn it back, it collide flat on the other side. And so what you want to do is just pull. And make sure when you do this, it's in a room temperature area. So, so what you're gonna do now is grab your screw and start laying it down. You might wanna use a paper weight or something to hold it down. Squeeze out all the wrinkles. that most of the wrinkles disappear, if not all of them. So you want to do the same with the other side. Good. And you want to squeeze it down. Now you can see that all the major wrinkles that would cause installation issues are gone. So now we can go proceed to start installing the flag. And now before we install, we gotta make sure that we are in temperatures of at least 70 degrees to 90 degrees. So it's not too cold or not too hot. If you see any bubbles like this one, we could just easily squeegee them out. Like some bubbles right here, some bubbles right here, some bubbles right here. Yeah, it can be easy to squeeze it out. Now, one of the things that I do like to do is I just add, like to add a little bit of heat around the edges to kind of seal them off onto the window. So you just either use a heat gun or a hair dryer. And as I'm heating it up, I'm just squeezing through. Okay. What the heat does, it helps it adhere onto the window a little bit stronger. So what we want to do now is we want to wait 24 to 48 hours uh, for the decal to fully adhere onto the window before we take it to any car wash.